So good morning you guys, it's coming up to 9.30 and I've just finished packing all of my stuff um, because I'm going to Watford today. So my boyfriend is actually on his way here, he lives in Kent, um, so he's been travelling for the last hour or so. He should be here pretty soon, he's actually have to come by train this time, um, a train and a bus because the taxis are all booked up because a lot of people are going to the airport because it's the 17th, because um, it's Monday the 17th of May when I'm filming this. So a lot of lockdown restrictions have lifted um, and I think from today people are allowed to travel and we're allowed to go to indoor venue and go to a restaurant and sit indoors and eat. So a couple of months ago um, I actually booked some tickets for us to go to the Harry Potter studio tour all the way in Watford um, hence why we're going to Watford in the first place. We've been there before, I think we've been there about four times so we're going to be spending two nights in a hotel. We're actually going to the Harry Potter tour tomorrow. Usually we get a about four buses to Watford and it takes us around four hours. This time we're actually going to go by bus and train. So we're going to be getting a bus from mine and then we're going to be getting a train to Victoria and then I think actually I think it's just one more train from Victoria to Watford Junction which is where the hotel is and also the shuttle bus that actually takes us to the tour which we will be using tomorrow. This is my travel bag. Um, it's a Ted Baker travel bag. It's a really lovely weekend bag. They don't do this exact design anymore because I've had it a couple of years but they do travel bags but in different designs and yeah it's really really nice in this pocket is where my iPad is gonna go um, and then the good thing about this is that if you turn it around you can actually pull it along with you so it's like a little suitcase which is really cool because this is incredibly heavy I've got all my stuff packed in there and I've just got my jacket from River Island which I'm going to be wearing just a really quick outfit of the day even though it's spring I was hoping that um, a few months ago when I had booked the tickets that this time would be really nice and really warm and I could wear like dresses and stuff and pack really light but no so yeah this is the weather predicted for this week so I've had to revert to wearing um, <laughs> jeans and jumpers um, so I've got on all black today I tried to pick something comfortable because we're going to be traveling um, so I wanted to wear something comfortable and hopefully I don't get too cold in this um, but I've just got this really thin jumper on um, I've got this black ASOS belt some Primark um, jeans and I've also got some boots and I've just got this scarf on from um, Primark I haven't had to wear a scarf since winter <laughs> um, and then I'm also going to be bringing my um, Ted Baker bag which I got I think last month when I was in London with Charlie and yeah I've absolutely love this bag because it's got three compartments um, it's a bit empty at the moment because I've just got my um, purse in there and my lip balm and my sweets and hand sanitizer I've still got a pop in my phone and all of that found a nice pair of Chelsea boots. I think I had to try about four different brands um, and these ones are by a brand called Shoe. Very good quality um, and I got these off ASOS and I'm just wearing some frilly socks from I think they were from H&M I think and yeah it's pretty much my outfit. And before I forget let me get my mask. So I've just got my face mask in here. I got this little pouch that says personal mask. I've just got my face mask which I have been loving. The Herschel Supply & Co brand. So Charlie's actually going to be here in a minute so I want to make myself a coffee really quickly. Um, last night I made myself my first coffee. It was really 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 nice. Yeah, we're just getting ready to head out now. There's Charlie. Got my mask on, ready to start our little adventure. All right, let's go. So we're just heading to the bus stop now. It's actually not that cold today, which is nice because I've got a thin jumper. Um, it's just the rain. I have got an umbrella. Just about to get off our first bus. Oh. This journey went quite quick and I think this was our longest journey, 40 minutes, but it went really, really quick. So we're just about to get off here and get the underground to Victoria. <laughs> right, so we're in the underground now and we're just waiting for our train. Is that our train there? 
initially where your face covered will be the most amount of all times at the intersection where you can be to protect us all. All change to the Victoria Line train to Walthamstow Central. Pass the mark information. So we're just getting our tickets now to um, Watford Junction, this is our last train. literally like two minutes away from the station so we're just about to go in there now the train was really quick but it was a bit more expensive um, than I thought because that ticket was 11 pounds so here's our hotel now we've just checked in but I'll give you guys a really quick hotel room tour like I do in all of my vlogs when we go traveling um so this hotel room reminds me of the first um, room that we stayed in when we first came to Watford the room is like set out pretty similar it kind of reminds me um, of that so here's the door and we've got a little mirror here we've just got our bags which we need to unpack we've got a TV we never really watch TV um, here we've got this Nespresso, Nespresso? Nespresso machine where you can have your coffee we've got a fridge down here the desk area chair and then we've got um the tea and some coffee bit chair this is our bed and then we've got two bedside tables so charlie's gonna have this up. we've got some extra pillows up there uh, oh we do have um slippers perfect <laughs> we've got slippers and a dressing gown normally they're on the bed um but they've got them in this bag because i wanted to put slippers on so i just changed into like a second pair of socks um because i don't like walking around bare feet the bathroom so this is what the bathroom looks like um got the little toiletries this is rubbish from the hand soap that i've just put down there um got this really nice big mirror we got this little mirror which is perfect for doing your makeup in and then we've got a bath slash shower and i swear we never had hand towels before maybe i don't remember but i don't remember there being a hook for um hand towels and we just got some extra towels up there that's our hotel room for the next two nights just finished unpacking all of my stuff I just took everything out of my bag that way it's a lot easier for me to find um, what I'm looking for I got some stuff over on that table my antibacterial wipe so I can wipe everything down um, and then I've just hung up my coat and my dressing gown and then I've just got my clothes um, up there but this is my new travel case I'm gonna go ahead and pop this in the bathroom I just wanted to quickly show it to you guys I've had this for a while i think i got it last year or the year before but i just haven't used it yet and it's just got all of my toiletries in there right so i've just put a fresh battery in i'm gonna have to charge my um other battery when we get back because i have to charge the battery in the camera so it's pouring with rain which is lovely but we're just about to um head out to go and get some lunch because i'm feeling really hungry um and we also need to get a few food bits and bobs um and we can do that in the local sainsbury I didn't get to show you guys my full outfit before I left out um, but this is what the jacket looks like on it's probably hard to see because I'm pretty much wearing all black
So we just got our subway. Hopefully you can see me because I just popped you on like the window ledge outside the building. So I just got a turkey, ham, cheese and sweet corn sub. I don't know what Charlie has got. He's got a whole mixture of different chicken, things. Chicken bacon and cheese. this hand cream because I've wanted the hemp one for ages and they don't do the almond milk and honey in the big side it's just the wrong thing this is a hand scrub this isn't what I wanted this is what I wanted because I wanted to get this for a little while so we're just in the cafe in Primark now and they have really nice Blueberry muffins, so I really want to get one. Yeah, yeah. and a millionaire shortbread. This is 20. Okay. Um, card. Huh? Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> We did get a few bits in Sainsbury's, a few snacky bits. We actually got really healthy stuff. So we've just arrived back at the hotel, Half soaking wet. <laughs> but I've got a muffin, which I'm really excited to eat. And we got some fruit. I got these strawberries because they looked really, really, really nice. Um, I also got these melon fingers. I got some sliced apples he also got some grapes as well so these can go in the fridge and these will be our snacks for today and tomorrow so good morning you guys excuse the fact i have no makeup on I'm just about to wash out this saucer and mug because i had some strawberries and melon and i also had a coffee um, for breakfast. Um, I didn't really like the coffee. I tried the espresso machine last night and this morning. The coffee is so strong um, and yeah, I didn't really like it. I'll just put you guys there. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and wash these up and Charlie's going to be up in a bit with some Greg's. I got a mocha and I also got a um, Spiky Mikey but I think they finally changed the name to a Star Biscuit. It's like a, some kind of shortbread dipped in chocolate. So we're just going to be going into the um, town centre to quickly grab some lunch. Uh, we might come back to the hotel to drop off some stuff if we need to. And then we're going to be heading off to the tour, which is very exciting. I to Charlie yesterday, I completely forgot that the reason why we're in Watford is because we're going to the tour. So yeah, <laughs> we're going to be heading off to the tour. So we need to get a shuttle bus, which is literally just down the road because um, it's at Watford Junction. So just by the train station and it's literally just down the road from our hotel. It's like a two minute walk. Our tour is at three o'clock. It's quite difficult putting lashes on. I mean, I'm getting better. But it is still quite a, a fiddly task. This is pretty much my, my makeup done. Um, so then we can pretty much get ready to, to head out now. And the room is going to be freezing when I leave the bathroom because Charlie got ready um, like an hour before I needed to get ready. And he's just sitting in the room in his jumper. And obviously he's got way too hot and he's got the aircon on. So it's absolutely 
freezing out there. Yeah, that is my my makeup done. Uh, my foundation looks like a completely different colour to my skin on camera, but in real life it's actually not that much. Um, it's not really that much of a difference. I've been loving this foundation recently. It's in the shade Caramel. It's the Revlon Colour Stay. It's really good for oily skin. I've just been watching some YouTube while I am um, doing my makeup. And as for today's outfit, I've just got this top on from um asos i did stitch this bit it probably doesn't look that nice but i quickly stitched it at home because it was just way too like open i've just got some blue jeans on and uh, my black asos belt. <laughs> got my mask on because we've got to wear it when we um walk through the hotel have you got everything yeah, I'm not sure if I've got the right way. So, we're at the hotel now, just on our way to Starbucks. We've got to be quick because we've pretty much got just less than an hour. This is what I want. Okay, can I just have one of these? Is that all? Yes. run up to our hotel room to get my tablets just in case I have a headache. Hello to Thank you. We finally do contactless payment before we had to pay with cash and now we can pay my card which is good so I need to cling on to this. We're here now and we have the tickets on our phone. Hello, oh, thank you so much. Hello. Is it two? Yes. Perfect. Just take the same here for me. Okay. Have a lovely day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is something we haven't seen before. It's the Slytherin common room because when we come this time, it's something to do with Slytherin, so there's quite a few Slytherin orientated features. It's like an interactive thing, like a big map. There's the prefix bathroom, the library. It's quite cool. So they use quite a few different dogs for fun. This is Mad Eye Moody's faux glass. I always wondered what it looked like. It's quite big. Just playing around with this interactive thing. It's quite clever. Here we have Lucius, Narcissa and Draco and the lady who played um, Narcissa, she passed away recently. I really liked her. I loved her character. Here we have the Sliverin, Salazar Sliverin's locket which is actually on Umbridge over there. And the floor's all squishy. So we're at platform nine and three quarters now and I think we might have a look in this shop. This is the railway shop. And they have sweets and stuff outside the um, shop. So Charlie got butter beer ice cream and I just got the butter beer drink. I've had this before, I didn't really like it last time but I wanted to to try it again. So we've just come to the tankard wash. I love this um, painting. This is by the artist Andrew Williamson. His artwork is really nice. On the um, Marauders map, we were talking about this in the tour, and I was thinking it'll probably be expensive, but it's only thirty pounds. That's a lot cheaper than I thought it was going to be. And Charlie's picked up a one as well. Oh yeah, let me hold that for you. you. Sure. So they have some new Quidditch stuff here. We've got the Ireland Quidditch team. 
Oh, and the holy had harpies as well. I've always wanted one of these mugs. One day I'm definitely going to get one. Oh, they also do bottles of bar beer as well now. You can get a single one or you can get the, um, the pack. Oh, and they have butter beer key rings as well. These are new. And this one's a bottle opener at the same time. And they have pins as well. These are all new. I might get one of these ones because it has the little gold thing which says it's actually her card. So I might get this because I'm no longer after Dumbledore because we got him last time. So yeah, I'm gonna get one of these. So I picked up the tin for someone which has all four founders in there and the chocolate frog and we got that last time. as well which I'm gonna to add to my collection but yeah spent way too much money that was a really nice trip we've got to get the um, shuttle bus back and then we're gonna drop our stuff off at the hotel um, I'll probably do a quick little haul and then we're gonna head out and go to Nando's for dinner but that was a really nice trip and I'm really happy with the stuff that I got in the in the gift shop, got some really nice bits this time. Did you enjoy that? What made you claim that apart? Yeah. No, the trip. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just waiting for our bus now, and it looks like they're doing an extension for something, which will be really nice. They're expanding the tour again. We don't know what it's going to be, and they never tell us, so we're just going to have to, to wait and see. I've had to resort to using my um, phone's camera because my battery died but I didn't get to show you guys before we got on the bus but this is what the um, shuttle buses look like and on each each one is a bit different. I think that's a Forbidden Forest one, I think. So that might actually be the bus that we're going to get on to go back. This is our bus. It is a Forbidden Forest one. Perfect. Right, so I thought I would do a really quick um, tour, um, tour, haul of what we got at the tour because we're going to be heading back out to go and have Nando. Um, so this is Charlie's bag um, and they also have these wand bags which we've had the last couple of times we've went which is really nice. So the wand he got is um, it's one of the exclusive design one. I think you might be able to only get this at the tour. I'm not entirely sure, but yeah, this was the first time we saw their new collection and he got the Phoenix wand. So let me try and show you that really quickly. It's got this really nice card. I want to get the um, Hufflepuff one to this. So the one Charlie picked up was a bit damaged. Um, I think this is just a really delicate wand so the guy was saying that you have to be very careful with it because the bit at the back it just chips off so this is what the this is what the wand looks like it's really beautiful the next thing uh got was um this is what me and charlie got last time it's a chocolate frog tin so it comes with the chocolate frog and it comes with four wizarding cards or actually comes with five so the four hound the four founders and dumbledore so that's what you get in there um, and then he got the chocolate frog with the new card. So every time there's a new card um, at the tour, it will have this little sticker which says um, new wizarding card inside. So you know that if you've got all the other cards, you know that you're actually getting this exact card, which is really cool. Um, Charlie picked up this key ring, which is a really nice one. I love my, oops, the bag just dropped. I love my key rings and my pin badges. And he got this really nice hogshead one, which is the pub 
or is it a pub? Yeah, the pub in Hogsmeade. So yeah, that's what that looks like. And he also got a sugar quill. I didn't get a lollipop this time because I never eat them. And the last thing he got, which I also got, was the Marauders map, which is really cool. This was only £30, which I was surprised about. I thought it would be like £60. Um, we was actually talking about this when we was walking through the tour and yeah I was pleasantly surprised so I got one of these and then this is my bag uh, I thought it would be very fitting to use my Harry Potter tote bag which is from Primark I got it a couple of years ago now so this is my my Marauders map um, we both got one of these bags um, we saw the paper bags and we thought oh they look nice um, and the guy was going to give us two plastic ones and was like can we have a paper one please so this is what it looks like on the back and I'm going to be adding this to my Harry Potter collection. Um, I'll show you guys the one that I got in a minute. Um, this is just the tankard from the, the butter beer. If you get it, you just wash it out. They don't seem to do the um, just the plastic disposable cups anymore. Um, you have to get it like this. Um, and I got the chocolate frog also. Um, the chocolate frogs are £8.95. The last thing I got was just this. Um, key ring so this is the I forgot what this is called the hourglass and yeah I just thought it was very Slytherin themed which was perfect for what we went for today for the Slytherin this was £14 um, and yeah I'm just going to quickly go ahead and show you guys uh, Narcissa Malfoy's one um, I really loved her character and um, she did pass away recently and you know as well thought it was fitting for uh, what was on today the whole Slytherin thing and yeah this is her wand and it's also my first ever Harry Potter wand all the other ones I have are just fantastic beast wands so we're just about to head out for dinner and I've just changed into my dress <laughs> So we're just on our way back to the town centre to go and get some dinner. So Charlie's just doing this on his phone. We have to join the virtual queue. We're just going to be getting our usual, which is the sharing platter. We get the boneless platter. Um, two garlic breads, two coleslaws, and two peri peri sauce chips. And Charlie's got a butterfly chicken bread. to the um, hotel. Nando's was really, really nice. Um, and yeah, so today's been quite a long and busy day. So I'm gonna end today's part of the vlog here and I'll see you guys tomorrow um, because I filmed so much today and I've got a lot of footage from yesterday as well. I've got like an hour and a half footage from yesterday. I'll probably have like an hour and a half or more footage from today. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. I'll take all this with me. Uh, we leave them in the room, and when you come back, just give this uh, back to us and then we we'll bring it back. To you. We've just left the hotel and we've left our bags and stuff at the um, front desk because we're just going to go into town and get some food bits and bobs um, for the trip back and then we're
and we're just going to go back to the hotel, collect our stuff and make our way back home. We're going to be going back by bus this time, so it's going to be a little bit longer. We went into one Greg's to see if they had a star biscuit, but they didn't. So we're going to go ahead and check in another Greg. We ordered one, but they called us and said that there weren't any, so they gave us two white chocolate chip cookies instead. So we're just going to go to the next Greg's and see if they have one, because I really want one. Thank you. Thank you. So we're just in Marks and Spencer's and I've just seen these ciders. They have this really nice one, which is with raspberry. I might get this. This sounds really, really, really nice. Yeah, so we just picked up some lunch stuff from this um, bakery that we went to on Monday. I've just got a roll and um, Charlie's got a roll and some sweet stuff as well. So we're just heading back to the hotel. just got home and Charlie's gonna be heading off to Kent in a minute and I've got lines on my face from where my mask was but I'm so happy to be home the travel back wasn't too bad just thought I'll quickly give you an overview of my outfit today so I just had on the same blue jeans I was wearing yesterday um yesterday when I went to the tour the only difference is I've got this stripy top and I've got a different necklace on and yeah so um I don't really have anything else to show with you guys I hope you enjoyed um coming away with me and charlie last couple of days i had so much fun and i hope you guys enjoy watching what we got up to um this video is over three hours so i'm probably gonna start editing that tomorrow and yeah so i'll see you guys in my next video so bye for now